Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome back to Subscriber Server. I'm Flinger Foo, and hey today, you know what? Uh, the new patch just came out, patch 257. So I decided that I was going to I was gonna try to cover as much of it as I could. I realize everybody else is doing the same thing. But you know what? This is the first time I've actually went out and tried to cover everything as quick as possible. So you know what? Might as well, right? Right. Okay, and I think today, I think today I'm gonna go look for the Deodon. Yeah, I think that's how you say it. Or the Hell Pigs. Oh yeah. Or the Hell Boars. But first off, I'm gonna go check out the uh, the new beehive and see how much honey they've got. And I gotta make sure I'm wearing all my ghillie before I go check this stuff. Because I left the stuff run overnight. Oh wow, we've got honey. We've got lots of honey. Oh, that's good stuff. And it uses a little bit. It used eight in that time. Oh, wow, a whole ton of honey. That's good stuff. All right, so, hey, and I guess these, uh, oh, de deodons, um, they have, like, this healing factor to them. Like, uh, their right-click ability is supposed to be able to heal neighboring dinosaurs, which sounds amazing for, like, soloing the bosses and stuff. It really sounds cool. Um, or at least, uh, you know, not even soloing the bosses, going in with a big group so you can, uh, have one person ride that because I guess their health gets up really high. All right, so um, yeah, I'm waiting on one of the subscribers to come over. We're gonna go out. We're going to uh, um, see if we can find a few of these things. Let me put back on my flak. It's pretty damaged, and yeah. All right, so yeah, I'm going to. Uh, I think we're gonna take out Thylacolio, but yeah. All right, that should be kind of fun, all right? So, hey, um, once that gets done, I will bring you back, and I'll see you guys in a bit. And we're back, and here's Sit. All right, he's been here for a while, and uh, you brought your Thylacolio, right, man? I did. He's right there. All right, sweet, because, you know, I mean, what's the fun in going out and finding these, uh, hold on, I'm going to get this right, I swear. Deodons. Is that it? I think so. I'm thinking that is right. Okay, if not, then we'll just call them hell boars or hell pigs. Does that sound good to that'll, you? That'll work great for me. <laughs> All right. Well, hey, um, we forgot the mutton, so we're going to go over. Let's go pillage uh, Doug's base. All right, maybe give him a Doug attack back and then go mm -hmm. grab some mutton. And then uh, we'll go out looking for these. How's that sound, man? Sounds good to me. All right, let's do it. Let's get on there. All right, so be very, very quiet. We're pilfering okay. Doug's base. Sneak in there. Right. Let's get it. You first. He seems to be unconscious. He does. He seems to be very blue. I wonder how he'd react if I painted his mohawk purple. Where's his dot? It's over here somewhere. I think it's in the second one. Nope. Here we go, the farthest right. Farthest right, okay. Oh, well, hold on, I don't, I didn't bring my scissors. Does he have scissors? Uh, I'm not sure. I will just dye his chest piece. Purple. And see how he notices. Just that, just a small thing. <laughs> Alright, let's go get the button. I don't know how he'll react to that. I don't know how he'll react to that either. Alright, so we're running low on mutton. Um, we got some cooked here. We do have cooked. Um, let's take the raw, and then uh, if not, we'll just finish off with the prime. Okay. Alright, I mean, we have how many sheep we need to slaughter still? A lot. Over here. Low shack. In the love shack, that's right. You can't Where's even that? get into the love shack, it's so full. Oh, man. Oh, my gosh. All right, well, hey, I think oh, here uh, we those go. things are taken care of. Oh, yeah, we only have a few. All right, you ready for this grand adventure to the taming pen and then... <laughs> and then chasing? Yeah, you yes. bet. Oh, oh, hold on. Yeah, I gates gotta go are for right way. man. Come on, you got Thylacolio. There you go. I'm learning. <laughs> Let's get this stuff done. So I won't have to worry about finding you ever if I get lost. Right, I'm the big bold so green guy. See, I didn't do this paint job. This was a dug attack job. 
turned out pretty good, if I have to say so myself. I yeah, I think it's all right. I mean, I haven't I haven't gotten rid of it, which is kind of cool. All right, not really your are. green, though, is it? It's not my green. Oh whoa, they're aggressive. What level? I was not expecting that. Twenty-four and twenty-four. Just twenty-four. Yes. No oh boy. Oh boy. Too late. <laughs> Get out of there, buddy. Got the coleos in there? Yeah, you could be. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you're killing him! Don't kill him! I didn't put him in the pit. Uh, it's alright. <laughs> alright, so, uh, yeah, we now have found out that a thylacoleo can get stuck in our wonderful taming pen and kill Just one of the up. deodons. Alright, well, hey. Um, and I remembered that I need to go repair my long neck before we head out on this <laughs> in the middle of the big adventure, and I'll be right back. Are you gonna be able to get that unstuck, dude? Oh, you nailed it! Alright! Figured it out. <laughs> See what it takes. Alright, and we're back. And this guy, he's only 24, so... Oh, and he's already aggressive on me. So I think I'm gonna find out just how many... Shocking trank darts to the face, a 24 female Deodon can take. Oh, look at that. What the hey? Oh, that is cool. It's a healing thing. It's like glowy crap. Well, three da darts and she's already running. I'm gonna let those sink in a minute. She's kind of ugly, but... Ah, oh, four don't. darts and she's down. All right. Oh, whoa, hey, whoa, even for a 24, she's got amazing health. Oh, all right, let's go grab some prime meat and stick looks that on like, her. Right, looks like Topor drops pretty quick. Whoa. Okay, well, let's go get some prime meat. And then I'll go get some narcotics. <laughs> to the mosh pit? Yeah, to the mosh pit. All right, I'll be right back. I'm going to go grab the narcotics. Okay. All right, coming back in with some prime meat. We're going to head over there and see how much it takes to actually tame this low one. So I think maybe we should, from that looks of that heal thing, we should probably split them up when we go to tame another one. I agree. I wonder if that affects their torpor as well. It could. I got ten? I got four. Maybe it doesn't drop as fast as I thought. Whoa, that doesn't tame hardly at all. Nope. Let me check the thing. It's it's taming effectiveness isn't still isn't dropping very much though. Right. I'm wondering if it's like the um Oh boy. I'm wondering if it's like the Fiomia? Just right. eats a ton? Yeah, that might be it. You want to throw some narcotics on this? Yep. She's already eaten all that. Yep. <laughs> She's going to get more. Let me just put some regular meat on her. Since we have the stack mod. Oh, let me just try one piece of mutton. There's 50 narcs on your thyla. Alright, mutton doesn't do crap for her. The, the raw mutton? Yeah, raw mutton doesn't do anything. Whoa, and her taming effectiveness drops fast. Yeah, this is With just like a Fiomia. With mutton it drops fast? No, her taming bar drops fast if you don't have food. Oh. All right, I'm going to go out and grab a whole bunch more stuff, dude. Oh, this might be an adventure in itself, just taming up a level 24. Yeah, I'm getting some more prime meat. Right, I think we, instead of uh, going out in the wild in, uh, on Thylacolio, I'm just going to go see if I can find a really high level one we'll drop in the taming pen. It seems like this is just going to be an adventure in itself, just taming it this way. And we're back. All right, well, hey, we got the saddle going for this little sucker. Let's stick that on there, and... Oh, this... 
This looks like the old style Anki saddle they had right when the game first came out. I wonder if they just reskinned the old skin. Huh. That's all. It needs a color. It does. It needs a dye. I didn't grab any. I should have. Yeah, I didn't either. Let's hop on this little sucker. Little tail. Yeah. <laughs> nice. he runs. Hey, hey, let hey me, look at my little tail. Let me go get hurt and I want to see how much it heals. Okay, yeah. Go go get yourself beat up. I'm gonna go jump off some. Uh, there's nothing really high around here. Alright. We've already got a level. What do we want to put it in? Let's go health. Let's see how much it gets per pump. Wow, 150. Wow. High level ones of these are gonna be... You're gonna have as much health as a T-Rex with high level ones. That's impressive. It is. I wonder if you can take that into the bosses with you. Yeah, that's primarily one of the main uses. Okay, I'm getting hurt here now. All right, you go, you go get beat up, and I, um, Dr. Flinger will uh, repair you, all right? As I long as you do a good job. I swear you will have all the limbs... Not necessarily oh, in the same do. spot, but you'll have all the limbs. That sounds okay to me. All right, you might have, you know, like an arm coming out of your ear and then a leg coming out of your chest. But I will stitch you back up. Are you going to use band-aids too? Yes, there has to be a band-aid okay. and then it has to be over a little stitch. You know, an X okay. stitch with a band-aid on it. You know, like the old cartoons. Okay, good. Yes. So it's a right click attack? Yes. All right. So we have, we're healing a little bit. All right. Go ahead and hit it. Wow. Whoa. That jumps up massively. That's like 50 yeah. to about 80 per tick. That is huge. And like 100 per tick on food on this guy. Wow. That's awesome. These guys so, are amazing. So can I stop it, you think, if I right click again? Try. You did. Yes. Hey, all right. Okay. Yeah, that took half his food just for that little time there. Holy crap! All right. Well, hey, let's uh, put this guy over at the base, and then we'll see if we can uh, go get us a higher level one. But that guy is really cool. That's impressive. It is. All right. Well, here's another pack. Sit found him. Uh, let's see. Well, what well, level two. are these guys? 12, 30, 12, 54. Oh, 102. Let's get that guy. And they're fighting a T Rex. Oh, quick, my grab goodness. the 102. Got him. I got that the looks really cool. Right. Hey, this is like white and black. I know. Take that guy back to the pen. I'm going to go see if I can find another. All right. So, hey, uh, I found another one set to go with our uh, one that uh, we already have. So, the other one was 102, right? Yes. All right, well, this one, bam, 174. That's not too nice. bad. I bet this guy's going to be a pain in the butt. But look at his colors. They're like red and black and stuff. This guy, he's a cool guy. He's ugly I haven't seen any more yet. Yeah, they're ugly. All right, so let's... Um, I'm thinking one of us is going to have to sit there and monitor their torpor while the other one goes out and gets a whole bunch of narcotics. Or, uh, goes out and gets a whole bunch of meat. Okay. And we'll just let them starve before we put any meat on it and then just stick, like, you know, like 10,000 meat on it. That sounds like a plan. All right. I'm going to put it in the front right taming pen. Okay. I'm just going to do Nailed a quick it. look here around. All right. Oh, let's there's get... a whole bunch right here down on the beach, right where you said you've seen the first ones. Oh, that's awesome. All right, we're going to get this guy knocked out while Sit's over getting some meat. And let's see how long it takes to knock this dude out. Come on, buddy. 150. Wow. Should Is I it pick female? Him That's male. You see a high-level female? Grab it and we'll uh, put back the 102. 42. All right. Oh, it is a female. Oh, sweet. Bring it in. 150. Yep. 
Oh, and he's down. All right, I need you to, or one of us needs to go get some uh, narcotics. Or not narcotics, yep. well, narcotics and uh, meat. Yeah, he still has a couple yeah, hundred Yeah, we gotta be on this guy. Put that one in the other taming pin. One of these here? Yeah, one of those there. All right, coming back in here, I've got a whole ton of prime meat. And we're using the stack mod here on the subscriber server. But if you do this all in one go, you should be able to get the same kind of results. I'm just going to throw all this stuff on him just to see how well it works. Oh, I'm encumbered <laughs> with meat. I'm meat encumbered. All right, um, let's see. Can I move it all? Barely. All right. Let's oh, yeah. Perisir Ethereum's the way to go. Oh, yeah. They provide a lot. All right. Let's throw all this on him, starting with Prime. And just let it go. I'll throw uh, some narcotics on him as well. Let's go with 20 of those. All right. Let's see how fast it tames up. This thing is taming up slow, dude. Wow. Prime? With prime. Tons of prime. Its food is way, way down. I mean, it auto-starves itself, which is kind of cool. But I put on, let's see, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 70, 80, 90, 120 or so-ish uh, prime meat. And wow. It's only at 10%, but it's like eating as fast as it can. It wow. gains 0.5% per prime meat. Wow. Yeah, that's pretty slow. So we're bringing in a whole boat. Yeah, we're going to need 200 prime meat for this guy. All right, now this 102 one that we got, the white one, I'm going to knock him out. I'm going to use regular darts. And then... I mean, Hopefully he, nobody he wants Pariser today. Right. Remember, he is mate boosted, so it'll take a little while. And, but... I'm gonna just use regular meat to tame this guy, just to see how long it takes. And also see how long just regular trank darts take. Come on, buddy. I'm not even close to running yet. Oh, there's the hit. Found the head hitbox. It's right around the mouth. The chin? Uh, kinda. Okay. I hit it once. Alright, he's out. I'm just gonna let him starve out for a little bit, and then I'm gonna um, throw a bunch of meat on him. See you guys in a bit. I'll go down there while you're doing that. Hey, no problem. All right, this, uh, this in there, and Sit was nice enough to go grab us three Iguanodon eggs, so we're going to try out some kibble and see how well that works and get us more medical brew. <laughs> that, that female's kind of cool color. I know, right? The greenish. And this white and black one. I like the green and the female, the green one. <laughs> yeah. She's pretty cool. She's like olive, though, but... And then I don't know. I can't really tell what color the male one is. It's black and uh, brown. Pumba. Right. Can we call him that? That's what he looks like to me. All right. I'm gonna see what one of these prime does, or one of these kibble does over on the 150. That's almost done. Let's put one on her. I bet it does 15. It's 61 percent. Let's get her to eat. Because this is the max level that they can have on the public server, so this is important that we find out. Okay. There, it just went. Oh, hey, 7.7. 7. 7. That's pretty good. All right. Um, yeah, let's throw the other two over on this big one that's taken forever. Okay, so that's good to know that these things take a lot of resources. A lot of resources. Well, we've already lost 34 Prime. I'm just gonna leave that spoiled meat there just to find out how much spoils while we're doing this, so sure. people know. Probably just gonna have to starve this guy out to uh, maximum hunger before you put any meat on it. I bet that's probably the way you're gonna have to do it. 
Probably wouldn't hurt. Right. Because you said it drops pretty quick, right? Oh, it does. This guy over here, the 102 with just regular meat, is taming up super fast. 70% already. I mean, his taming effectiveness isn't worth crap anymore, but look at he's the going difference fast. Yeah, but look at the difference between the health on the one we just tamed before and this one. It's already up like 3,000. Wow. So if you want to quick tame them, meat just does it a lot faster. But that's if yes. you don't care about the taming effectiveness. If you do care about the taming effectiveness and you want the best, uh, prime or kibble. And, I mean, this guy's already at 97.4, so he's already lost a level. It's just like uh, taming uh, Filmia with stimberries. Right. Yeah. Almost just like it. All right, I put some cooked mutton on it. I'm just waiting for it to eat. I'm just regular mutton on it. I'm reg just uh, waiting for it to eat on the 174. This The prime meat was giving it 0. 0.5. Okay, so the mutton gives it, instead of 0. 0.5, right gave it 1.3. So mutton does work. It just takes a lot of mutton. <laughs> yeah, so if you were going to mutton tame this guy, I would have the Ovis right next to it. And I would slaughter the Ovis when this guy's food was down to like, I'd say maybe a thousand. Because their food, I mean, 8,700 food right now. And get it down to like a thousand, just let them starve out. Slaughter a mutton or a sheep right next to them, throw every bit of it on it, and then just watch them go. I bet that would tame it out pretty easily. All right. Or is it mutton? No, it already ate the mutton. The mutton finished it through the 90s. 60 spoiled meat. So that's how much prime we lost was 60. But that's because we didn't... Uh... Oh, and it's up! Hey, all right! And Griffin was nice. killed. Griffin always dies. He always says he didn't die. He doesn't die very often, but he does. He does. He dies all the time. Oh, man, take a look at these stats on this one. They're not wow. as, they're not that great. <laughs> not what I was expecting, but you know, seven thousand health though. That's pretty good. Three twenty melee damage, that's not much better than the one fifty. The one fifty came out at fifty five hundred health, one thousand stamina. What's that one's stamina over there? Thirteen hundred. Okay, alright. What's that one's weight? Weight is 688. Okay, no difference here. This one's 664. What's its melee damage? 320. This one's 333. This one right here, this one's pretty good. 150? And that's the same as the public servers right there, because we don't modify the dinos themselves, just their level. Right. That's awesome. All right, let me put a saddle on this guy, and you can ride it around. Yeah, if you could get the health from this guy onto her... That'd be oh, a yeah. pretty darn good pig. And then the color from the white one onto her. So it, you'd have to go through like three or four different breedings, but you could make the perfect one. All right, I'm going to grab this dude. You grab one. Do you want to show how much prime this guy went through? Yeah, it was quite a bit. So we ended up putting like 300 and some on this guy. Okay, that's how much he has left. That's, that's, yeah. that's quite a bit, but it's not m nearly as much as I was thinking. Right. So he took literally about 200 prime plus, well, the mutton. You know, it was seven mutton by the time I ended and up putting on it. Two kibble? And two kibble, yes. <laughs> so 200 prime, seven mutton, and two kibble. So yeah. All right, well, let's take these dudes out. Grab the 256, dude. Let's do it. Let's go. Let's go see what um, boars do or hell boars do in the mosh pit. Oh, they jump. Oh, dude, they do. That is amazing. I mean, it's not like an amazing jump, but, you know, oh, hell it's a lot pig more mobile jump. than, you know, most other dinosaurs. So, hey, that's pretty cool. I know it's not a dinosaur. It's a mammal. Oh, look at that. That's cool. <laughs> that's neat. I'm digging it. So does he do it when we need it? I think he just does it periodically. That's kind of cool. I think it just lets you know, hey, this there's a thing going on.
128 damage. Oh, that thing just nice. disintegrated. Oh, here's one of the spiky dudes. Oh, Let's spiky get him. dude. Can we get him? Oh, what's his level? Oh, 24. 24. Kill him. Oh, his main boosted. Oh, <laughs> he, stuck, he spiked our guy. Get him. You can't spike our dude. That's oh. our dude. <laughs> right over here. What level is it? Here it is. Level 24. Hey, let's get him. Oh, what? Oh, he, he spiked, spiked you. me. <laughs> Give me that back, dude. I like that guy. Thanks. Wow. Wow, my dude is... I didn't take... I mean, I did take oh. damage, but it's already healed. Oh, you didn't peeve off a Dwarf Dawn, did, did you? I did. I may have. But you might want to... Don't worry about it. Your life. Things they they do a lot of damage. How much does it? Let's see. How many levels do we have? We have three levels. How much do I get for one pump of hell? Fifty-five, eighty. Wow. You only have three. I have four levels now. Um. Wow, I got over five hundred health per pump. What about melee damage? Not bad. Uh, Eleven percent per pump in melee damage. Wow, yeah, I'm just going to take this guy up in hell. Wow, that is awesome. And then when you get up there, you can just, well, jump to get out of that BS. And then right-click. Oh. And then his health just goes up so fast. That is awesome. Oh, and he's almost out of food. Look at that. Oh, he just can't eat fast enough. That is insane. Wow. All right. So, hey. Uh, yeah, I think that's going to do it for this episode. If you liked it, click that like button. I really appreciate that. And if you're new around here, subscribe. All right. So, hey, until next time, this is uh, Flinger Foo and say your name, Sit. Oh, Sit. All right. Hey, and take it easy, everyone.